Well, I was going to record a vlog, but apparently I don't have all of the parts for my heat sink and fan. So you get another one of these for right now. Yay! Uh, welcome back. This is part six of my Oh Gods, Why Am I Playing Beyond the Beyond? Well, I am about to enter this ca cavern once more. Keep in mind, I am entering a dungeon I'm not really supposed to be in right now, so that's part of the reason why it's so hard. The other part being that this is the hell section of Beyond the Beyond. I receive a broadsword! I believe that, yep, that is in fact better than what I already have. Like I said, this is not the area I'm supposed to be in, but you know. I should be able to survive it, I think. I just have to kind of be careful. Very careful. And you'll notice that I'm not going to be speeding through too many of these battles. Two sets of Dark Priests. This is gonna suck. Oh, Edward's down to 10 hit points already. Good. I should be generally okay now. Ah, email. Why am I being followed by a random company? Whatever. So, um, I believe somebody had asked why I don't heal in combat. And beyond the beyond, if you heal in combat, you actually end up healing for less than if you heal out of combat. That's the reason why I try to heal outside of combat. Ooh, healing herb. Great. Just what I needed. And I'm not being sarcastic there. Use on Eddie. There we go. So yeah, like for instance, that healing herb would heal, I think it's, it's like 20 or 30 out of combat. And it heals... Oh. That one I can do. Um, and it heals 75% as much in combat. I thought that's where I was supposed to go. Oh, I know what's going on. I went in this dungeon when I need to leave this dungeon. It's the other direction, maybe. I can't remember now. Now I'm getting confused. If they're still alive, please silence one. Because I'm gonna die otherwise. Good. Only get winded once, if at all. Yay! Of course, that means Edward silencing the blood pudding. So far, not too bad. This is also a decent experience. Although, already need to use another healing item. Healing herb. Okay, maybe there was something else outside that I didn't notice? Nope, pretty sure I would have noticed. Yeah, that's gotta be one way. That's the entrance. Hmm. Oh, right. Oh, I forgot about its idiosyncrasies on this dungeon. I don't like you, game. Bow! Let me guess, Samson's being stupid. Oh, hey, look, Samson's being stupid. 
Who would have ever guessed? Damn it, Samson. Well, at least now I'm only dealing with melee characters. They're easier to deal with. Even if Samson's nearly dead already. Edward's at least doing damage now. That helps. Samson, you just need to defend. I'm sorry, you suck. He's gonna take out Samson, I'm saying. Nope. Yay. Yes, Edward. Finish him off. Yeah! Go, Edward. And heal Samson. Again. Okay. Oh, right. This is a maze, isn't it? And there's nothing out here anyway. Well, that was worthless. Hi, Boo Kitty. Oh, Boo Kitty doesn't want to be picked up as usual. Oh, well. Okay. Back in. Go through to the stairwell. Okay, I see a treasure chest. I can't get there from here. I see an outside. This is the one that drops me down, isn't it? No, it isn't. Okay. Okay, this place isn't getting me anywhere, as usual. Amazon Priestess, I don't like you. Yes, Amazon, I know I ordered a new thing. You're probably dead, aren't you? Yay! Only 45 XP, come on! Uh, I can't... Nope, that was a mistake. They were both mistakes. They were mistakes to be had here, what can I say? Don't mind me. Wait, did I actually find the exit? I think I actually found what one of the items I was looking for. That works. That's stupid. Damn it, Samson. Oh, well, at least I found the object that I haven't been told about yet. But it's a magic emerald! It's obviously important because it's in pink. Yes, let's have a random battle while I'm climbing on vines. Somehow this works. Ah, uh, damn it, elves. I'm gonna get winded, aren't I? That's right, I'm faster now. I might not be winded. Nope. <sighs> but at least Annie only takes four now. Yay, resist item! Uh, let's see, Samson needs healing for sure. I'll have Annie heal him. Magic, not item. There we go. Going in here, because this is literally the only place I can go. Oh, hey, look, it's this room again. So I guess I'll go this side. It's the only other place I can go. Okay, that's the quick way out. 
so I must be on the right track. Hate you all, game. I hate you all. I'm probably charged now. I can always plug it back in if I need it. Attack, 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 and... Ah, screw it. Oh, hey look, that was not painful. I'm shocked. Painful is pretty much the point of the game, isn't it? Uh, I think Edward can take another hit. Flame card! Okay. Useful. Pretty sure there was nothing down there, but I want to double check. Hate! You know what? Burn whatever's left with fire. By the way, I am button slamming. Good. Totally worth it. Yeah, it's a waste of fire, but that's okay. Bonk. Oh, hey, look, Eddie leveled up. Plus three strength again. Am I gonna have to start putting him in the front row? Okay, there's still one treasure chest that I know of left. I remember it being a pain to actually get at. I'm not referring to this one. I actually forgot about it. Power Gauntlet. Any? I don't think that one's yours. I think it's Samson's. Plus one. That's it. One. Damn it, game! Right, I'm going this way. Two ghosts. Not messing around with this. Holy light! Have fire back! Yeah, you don't like the fire as much as I like the ice. I like the ice. We actually only have two healing items left. This is the exit. You can tell because there's like dandelions. Yeah, Hobgoblin, I do not care about you game at all. This game is very pro mage. And healer. Mostly mage. Really? Thank you. Damn it, Samson. So my theory as to how enemies decide what to do is based off of if they've been damaged or not. Because so I've noticed this run that whenever enemies are damaged, they seem to use more effective tactics. Maybe that's coincidence. Maybe it's not. I honestly don't know. McWed get leveled up! Hooray! That level up sucks. That, on the other hand, is nice. Escape is guiding branch, basically. Alright. Second half of the dungeon. I believe. Ghouls! I hate ghouls. Hate. Well, my holy light was worthless. Oh well. 
Damn it, Samson. Yeah, escape costs 8 and I only have 6 MP, so that's not going to be useful. You know what, Samson? You can heal yourself. I honestly don't remember what path to choose. So many random encounters that hurt. Harpies. Harpies bad. Good. Damn it. Not dead yet. Good. Five. And why are Harpies' breasts exposed? Whatever. Harpies can cast Wind 2 if I remember correctly. Might just be Wind 1. Damn it. Might just be Wind 1, but. I honestly don't remember anymore. It's been so long since I've gotten to this point, because I usually give up about where I... about right before arriving in this dungeon. Uh, Lizardmen, I think, just attack. Damn it, Samson. There's still one treasure chest that I can't remember how to get to. Oh well. Orc Lord. Those are easy. Die! Okay, you can heal yourself, that's fine. You know why? Because I will damage you more than you have just healed anyway. Even if Samson does not. So another thing that I've noticed about this game is that mages are fast. Very fast. There's no real reason for it, to be honest. Okay, there is a stairwell there. I need to check the other way just for due diligence. Okay. Lizard man and ghoul. I think the ghoul is the bigger threat. Okay, Samson might end up getting hurt badly. I'm actually doing a lot better in this run than I normally do. Might have something to do with the fact that I'm trying to be a little cautious compared to my normal. Uh, now we need to use items. Also starting to run a little low on healing, which is bothersome. Okay, is there anything even over here? No. That's what I get for due diligence. Just one ghoul. It's not that big of a deal. They hurt, but that's it. Friends playing Reseteer? I mean, it's a good game. Just... Now? Okay. I, I say this as I'm playing, you know. Beyond the beyond. Ooh, I didn't realize how low Samson was on hit points. Oh well! Might just lose some LP. Not the end of the world. Blood Pudding had an antidote. Hint, that means Blood Puddings can poison people. Seriously, game? That was like six steps. RP! I forgot to heal Samson. Again. Oh well! Oh, yeah, that's right. That's what harpies can also do. They can summon more of themselves. I remember this problem all too well now.
Let's fix that problem, shall we? One of them's gone. Zombie's gone. Gonna summon another one? Nope. You're just gonna die. With a overpriced fire tube. That's okay. There's no bosses around anyway. It's a really long time in this game before you actually fight your first boss. It's not quite the halfway point, but much closer to that, I would say. Oh. How am I doing on heal? You've got three. Go ahead and give Sammy a heal. Up or down? I'll try up. Okay, that's where that goes. And that was it. Damn it, me. Double damn it, me. No, I'm not going to run any out of MP. So I probably should have ran Edward out, but that's okay. Ow! Now you're starting to see Samson's major issues, rather than just the minor issues of Samson being an idiot. Summoner. Good. Yes, double critical, please. Don't want to deal with you summoners. The higher level versions then can summon an enemy that can insta kill you, just for fun. Along with a lot of other different types of enemies. If they're annoying. Seriously? Well, at least there's no longer a second, you know, random step for no reason. Ghosts! Hate ghosts. Hate everything in this dungeon. Ah, now I need to heal Annie. And people wondered why I bought so many healing items. Ha! Huh. So everybody's down to two now? Looks that way. Think that's the end? Yes! Yes, I'm outdoors again! Just need to get to town! Almost there! Yeah, you and I can handle. There we are! This is actually, by the way, the end goal of where we need to go for Samson's quest. This is Simone. Apparently they don't get visitors very often. But you know what they do get? In money! It's only 40. Totally worth it. Yay, I have MP again. Huh. So Simone's a very special village. It's a village full of mages, basically. Um, this is also the only shop in the village. However, uh, let's see, they do have equipment, which is not much. I will totally pick up the Holy Ribbon for Annie. Yep. Holy Ribbon, is that the first one that actually does something? I can't remember. Eddie. Yeah, if I remember right, they don't have weapons in this dungeon. Or in this town. Yeah, there's a couple of pieces of equipment I'd like to sell, like that long sword. And it's not that I want to sell it for money. I want to sell it to get out of my no, get out of my stupid inventory. Eh. Uh, do, 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 do. Samson's the only other one. Yeah. No. Okay. Uh, I'll buy healing items on my way out. Dun, dun, dun. Wonder what's going to happen? How about a disaster? Great. 
evil is engulfing the common world. The Master Magicians are using their magic to gain information. Yeah, apparently they consider everything outside of this small little area the common world. Like, I was a simple commoner. The common world. Yes. Continue. For we've got a job to do. So... This is another one of those areas where it's kind of obvious this is a training game, because Xeon is the name of the big bad in Training Force 2. No relation, by the way. Just, they like to reuse names, apparently. They do in the training games as well. Luke, for instance. Eastern Path in this village leads to the Mystic Shrine. Great magical forces gather there. However, there's a rock in the way. But you can't go there now because of the rock blocking the path. That's right. It looks like you can walk through the trees or things. Yeah, no. There's a rock in the way. He didn't want to be disturbed, so he put the rock there. And the only people that can move the rock are Master Xeon and God. Yeah. That's basically just there to make sure you don't circumvent plot. Um. Hmm. Transformation powder. Nobody wants to steal transformation powder, right? Yes, you must be very careful of handling it. Hint, hint, hint. By the way, do you ever move from your bookshelf? No, you don't. Okay. Taunt! Taunt! I wonder what that's about. Yes, he's mastered both black magic and white magic. You don't get to use him, by the way. I just walked out of town, didn't I? No? Oh, yeah. Their library is in a tree. If you can't tell, these are elves! The magic encyclopedia! Complete the re legendary resurrection magic. You actually find him later on. White magic is commonly known as healing magic. Black magic is mainly used in battle. No, healing magic is also mainly used in battle. Let's be honest here. I'm just weird the way I do mine. Master magician Merlin. But he disappeared in the fjords north of Marion. That, it, by the way, is your only other hint as to where... That is the only hint in the entire game where you can get resurrection magic. That's it. Absolutely nothing else. <laughs> Labyrinth of Arwen is the most annoying place ever. Hmm, second most annoying. Shh! The evil disaster. Me. No, it's not me. I'm joking. Oh, this is a big room for not having anything in it. Hint, hint. Yep, that's right. Aran, according to their stuff, is a space alien. Um, that's it. That's pretty much all the characterization that you get for the overlord of this world. I don't know why, just is that way. All sorts of empty barrels. If I remember right, they're all empty. There's an antidote in one, the second most worthless item in the game. Ah, well, I'm going to stop here because my mom's calling. Be right back.